Hi, I'm XTV producer Jennifer Moore, and I wanted to share this with you. You might not know this, but if you work at a TV station, over a period of years, you end up getting a lot of station swag, like a lot of station swag. Pretty much every newsroom makes tons of promotional items, t-shirts, caps, bags, coffee mugs, anything you can think of. One station I worked at even had station branded chapsticks. So if it exists, you can bet some TV station is probably going to stick their logo on it and give it away as a promotional item. So this is just a very small percentage of my swag collection, but I was kind of reminiscing, you know, going down memory lane and I thought it might be interesting to take a look at everything I've accumulated over the years just to kind of see what I had. So here we go. And by the way, if you're curious about what it's like working in a TV newsroom, feel free to subscribe to this channel because hopefully I'll be bringing you more and more content. But let's kind of take a look at some of the things that we've got here. So most of the items, because CNN was the last place I worked, most of the items I've got here are from CNN. I've worked at several other TV stations and I would say I've probably streamlined about 80 to 90% of everything I had. Especially after you stop working at a station, it can't, seems a little silly to keep wearing the t-shirt around town. And I don't know about other TV journalists, but I actually would try to avoid wearing my station branded swag around just because when people see you wearing like a CNN shirt or like a Bay News 9 shirt, you know, they start asking you a lot of questions or they'll be like, are you with the news? I've got a story with for you, you know? So sometimes if you want to deflect attention, unwanted attention, I would really avoid wearing this stuff in public. So how do you get station swag? Well, if you work there, you will end up getting a lot of it. Um, I've got coffee mugs from every, pretty much every station I've worked for except for one. I used to have a travel mug with the ABC Action News logo on it, but the printing kind of washed off and the mug got really, like the travel mug got kind of gross, so I ended up throwing it out. Over the years, I've had probably at least six, I would say at least 60 station t-shirts from various places. Uh, the first station I was at, it was a Fox station. They didn't have K-Fox. All right, I've got the coffee mug here. They didn't have like a ton of station swag, but when I started, they gave me a little like welcome package that had like a coffee mug, a t-shirt. I don't know, honestly, I don't even know where the t-shirt is, but I still have the coffee mug to remember. K Fox fondly by. After that, I worked at a station in Florida called Bay News 9. It's a 24 hour cable station. And oh my gosh, the swag at Bay News 9 was like out of this world. That station, that's the one that had the chapstick. I also have the uh, Weather on the Nines tote bag. I've got several mugs from there. And I had like a gazillion, like honestly, a giz like so many shirts, polos, you know, flannels, whatever you can think of. I think I even did have like a, like a little fleece jacket. So I had, I've had a lot of things from that station over the years, but after I left, like I've been trying to streamline what I have and I ended up, I wasn't even sure what to do with the stuff. So I donated a lot of those shirts to Goodwill. Sorry, Bay News 9. It was great working there, but you know, you just can't keep, you can't keep all of this stuff. So even what you see here, I probably have more stuff around the house that I just don't know where it is, but I at least wanted to have the, the coffee mugs out. And yeah, so Bay News 9, I have, I've had a lot of stuff from there. In fact, one year for Christmas, they gave the station employees Bay News 9 Afghans. So that was kind of, kind of a unique thing. So stations are always thinking about kind of cool and unique things to, you know, make promotional items for. They can get very creative. All right, so um, after that, I was at a station called ABC Action News for a time and, oh, whoops. Okay, there goes the there goes the CNN champagne flutes. So I do have a shirt from there. I think I had a couple other things from there, but I again I don't really know where they are. So, but the shirt's actually pretty comfortable and it's cool looking. So I still do have that. That's actually one of the only things I have left from ABC Action News. And then it was to CNN, and CNN obviously is the majority of this stuff. And CNN. You know, a lot of this stuff was given to me, but also CNN has its own gift shop. So if you are interested in your own CNN swag, you can purchase it online or at the Atlanta C 
CNN Center. The website is cnnstoreonline.com. And some of this stuff was actually purchased at the store for, some of it was intended as gifts and I just never gave them away. But once you start working there, you kind of start buying things to give to people because it's cool. So I've got like cups. Uh, I actually got, we go, these shirts were given to me for some like company milestones. We've got that. And somewhere I've got my CNN three year like plaque somewhere. I've got this shirt here. This is the one I was wearing in a previous video on one of my channels. I meant to give this as a baby gift to someone but never got around to it. It's a little plush CNN live truck. So we got that. And yeah, so we've got, there's so much CNN stuff here. Let's see here. That I've got even a CNN fidget spinner. We've got more cups, notebooks here, and this little like plastic travel cup thing here. But one thing I did buy at the gift store, and we did get a company discount at the CNN store since we were employees. But even without the discount, I find that the prices at that gift shop were actually pretty reasonable for the item. Sometime last year, I picked up this CNN like parka and the retail price is only 55 bucks. And for a pretty warm winter jacket, I thought this was actually a pretty good price. So uh, if you go to the CNN store in downtown Atlanta, this is not a commercial for the CNN gift shop, uh, but I am telling you, if you wanna get some CNN swag, that's where you can go. This is actually a pretty comfortable jacket. It's very warm. So I still have this, although I still have the tags on it, so I haven't really worn it, but you know, if you would like to look like a CNN anchor reporting on severe weather, this is what you can buy at CNN, I think, storeonline.com. So that's just some of my swag from over the years. And again, I've gotten rid of, I've gotten rid of a lot of it just because you just, you just can't keep it all. There's just too much. But uh, yeah, we got some champagne flutes and yeah, just a lot of, a lot of cool stuff and lots of good memories. So I just thought it would be interesting to share. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, feel free to smash that like button and subscribe if you would like me to be your guide inside the media industry.